Are you guys ready for your next comedian? Uh, we got to go back. We got to start at the top. Yes, we support our vets. Are you guys ready for your next comedian? That sounds so good. You won't get electrified, but you might feel something. Here's what. Hot dog. I don't know why I said hot dog, honestly. Um, you ever get in a situation where you just say random things because you're nervous? Well, this is a situation for me. Um, but fun fact, not only do I say random stuff, my body goes all agricultural and I turn it into a crop duster. So apologies up front, second row, huh? I get spicy. Um, but no, uh, you know one thing you're not supposed to do, and really it's not that you're not supposed to do it, it's more like frowned upon. Um, you don't fart in the shower, right? Um, fellas, you know, because when you do this, it intensifies the smell, right? Um, and as weird as that is, I still do it. Uh, I think it's because I'm a guy. Guys are weird. Um, especially when you let us out in the wild. But guys, uh, why can't we just act normal in a sauna, right? A sauna is designed to help us. <laughs> yes. Uh, the sauna was designed to uh, help us sweat, relax, you know, possibly get rid of last night's bender. Um, but it's, it's not designed to turn into a transformation box, turn you into a peacock, right? Peacocking, I'm going to explain what that is. It's, it's when a male peacock just fluffs up in feathers, right? Puts on, the, oh, sorry, uh, puts on a display um, uh, for a female, right? To get her attention. I say this because, like, I walk into a sauna, there'll be a couple of dudes already, you know, relaxing, enjoying their time, quiet. I sit down, same. Next thing you know it, female walks in, right? One guy, all of a sudden, he starts swaying, right? Hey, starts swaying. Second one, puts on a lip singing concert that we didn't even know we were supposed to attend. He's all like, Right? And then the third, the last one you expect to show up in a box that's running about 110, 140 degrees is someone from 1980s, Mr. Breakin. He just gets up and he's just starting moving, right? Hey, I don't know, some, something just not felt him compelled to start move. Um, and as weird and as exciting as to watch, I'm like, all right, who's going to pass out first? Uh, <laughs> and, I, and I get caught up into it too, right? Like, it's like when I go to the gas station, and ladies, you, you follow me on this one. Do I stop at the even dollar amount or the even gallon amount, right? <laughs> it's funny because girls don't get gas, right? Yeah. Um, but no, it's like, <laughs> but it brings you back into the box. Like, do I get out when I told myself I was going to get out, or do I just keep watching? But I do have some advice for you, ladies, when you're in that situation. Just go ahead and rip one. <laughs> I just got to hit Pee Wee tonight. Um, go, go ahead and rip one. But caveat, be aware of your audience, right? Because you might get cuffed up. All right. So <laughs> anyways, um, enjoy the rest of the show. Thank you. That's my time. Fred. <laughs>